Hey, black ladies. So today, I will actually be taking down the roller set. I didn't put it up on um, video because I was being lazy. Mind y'all, I am pregnant. So y'all about to get a whole bunch of that for an excuse. I was pregnant. I'm pregnant. I can't do it because I'm pregnant. That's about to be me. Look, my stomach running right now. You want to know why? Because I'm pregnant. Okay. <laughs> Okay, anyway, so for this roller set, I wanted to do a tight roller set because I wanted to see how I would look with bangs. Um, like the little curly bangs. You know, like when you have like a natural pro and you got like the, the curly hair with the little bangs going on. It's just so cute to me. So I did small rollers, but the next time I do a roller set, I actually want to go with the rollers that are smaller than those rollers. So I think like either the blue ones, it's a couple of blue ones inside of the roller set, but either the blue ones or the red rollers. If you know those red rollers, you know those are like small. So I'm sure not probably, I'll do like probably a little section on the video, but it's going to take me forever to get those in. But I really wanted the small ones because two, the smaller the rollers, the tighter the curl and the longer your roller set lasts. So um, I'm trying to delay on doing the interlock. So I was like, let me just do some small, small rollers so that this roller set can last me at least a week or a week and a half. I, if I can do two weeks, that's a blessing. Okay, I'm saying right now that's a blessing. Now, the only thing I used for this roller set was the K Essentials, um, her, her, their hair product line, which was the oil and then the hydrating spray. And I did that. Yeah, I, I didn't like wet my hair completely with it, but I did moisturize my hair with that. And then while I was putting the rollers in if my hair started to get a little dry i just dampened it with a little water but i just did damp spray like i didn't spray heavy because i wanted to sleep with them in overnight and then the next day i wanted to just take them out and they worked perfectly so if you do this you don't have to use no mousse or nothing you can if you want to but that's only if you know you better to wash your hair um so i didn't use nothing but water you can use water on like a little light oil gel. It ain't nothing major. At night, make sure you tie your hair up like how my hair was with the scarf around. I just tie my hair up around the edges so that none of the rollers would come around, come down, or like unravel or nothing. And that was it. I took them down this today. Well, on this day, because when I post this, it's not going to be that day. But anyways, um, once you take them down, what I normally do is take my hands and kind of like separate them, but you'll see, child. I got, I got your separation. Okay, so now I'm just gonna separate the front curls because I did kind of want those to stay straight temple, but my hair is so long in the front. And then I took the girls to school. When I took a little break, I took the girls to school and it was kind of raining, so it kind of rained on my curls, but it's okay because I had already planned for my hair to be longer in the front than what I wanted. So just take your hands and separate the curls. If you want, you can kind of take them and spiral them out so that they keep a spiral curl to it, but it wasn't that deep for me. I just wanted the ends to stay really short and simple. And um, for the front part, since it did not do what I wanted it to do from, from jump, but it's not because of the rollers, honestly. It's just because my hair is longer at the front. It's not long at the front, but it's just long at the front. You know, like I don't have the short bangs. So if your hair is, like if you have shorter locks, hurry up and do your spiral. Get all of your cute spiral curl styles out now, child, because I'm going to tell you right now, the longer your hair is the stronger you gotta fight okay you gotta put up a strong fight but anyways what i did was pull my hair back um like kind of to the top of my head and then i slid clothes pin bobby pins right where those right you see like you, you get what i'm saying you get, you get that you feel it you see that you see what that did you see how it brought that up just like that y'all like that okay because that's what i like to see but anyway so i did that and I just pulled it up and I framed it. So the first style that I was trying to do was the little Chinese bang look with the curly hair. Cha 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 cha. I fought. You hear me? I fought for my life for these bangs. I did. And they really did turn out cute. But I'm such a side part girl. I end up doing the side part. I wish I would have took some pictures of this look because it really was cute. Like it was full looking. But it was just like some pieces was not acting right. So I was like I'm not about to be child 
I'm about to do that. But I did keep the bobby pins in when I did the side part because it still gave it like a little pin up look. I really did like how the short bangs looked with the full roller set. So all in all, um, the Chinese bangs was a look and then the side part was a look. So in the comments, y'all let me know which one y'all like best. And then let me know how you work your roller sets. Like what do you do? Do you normally style your roller sets soon as you take the rollers out? Or do you take some time and wear them down? I like to take the time, wear them down, get a little feel for the curls. And then like that next week, I'll style them. So I may style, do a one or two styles next week with this roller set if it, you know, still, if it's still looking cute. If not, just get what we can get and don't throw a feel. That is cute. I really, I should have kept the little Chinese bangs. That was real cute. But anyways, thank y'all for watching. I will see y'all next week. Stay tuned for the side part look because that's the look that I ended up going with at the end of all of this. Bye, y'all. Peace out.